Hi, I'm Kari Yastrzemski, and I've got a strike zone to deal with every time I play ball. But did you know that you've got a strike zone, too? Right in your own home. It's the area from your chest to the floor in every room. It's where you should never keep matches, because little kids spend all the time in that strike zone, looking for things to play with. So keep your matches up high. Keep your matches out of the strike zone. A public service message from the National Fire Protection Association and this station. This is Rico Petroselli, and I care about two strike zones. One's right over the plate from the chest to the knees. The other's from the chest to the floor, everywhere in my house, and yours too. It's where we should never keep matches, because it's where our little kids spend all their time looking for things to play with. And if they find matches, they can get hurt. So let's remember, keep matches up high, out of the strike zone. A public service message from the National Fire Protection Association and this station. The more you know about the strike zone, the safer your kids are. I'm Fergie Jenkins, and I'm not talking about the strike zone I'm always pitching at. I'm talking about the strike zone in your home. It's an area from your chest to the floor in every room. It's where you should never keep matches, because it's where kids spend most of their time looking for things to play with. And if they find your matches, they could get hurt. Don't let it happen. Store matches out of your strike zone. A public service message from the National Fire Protection Association and this station. This is Brooks Robinson. I hope you don't have any matches in your strike zone. See, you've got a strike zone in your home, just like we've got one in baseball, only yours is bigger. It's from your chest to the floor, in every room. And it's where your little kids spend most of their time looking for things to play with. They can get hurt if they find your matches. So don't let them. Keep those matches up high on a shelf or something, out of the strike zone. A public service message from the National Fire Protection Association and this station. The little kids at your house spend most of their time in the strike zone. I'm Jim Palmer, and I don't mean the baseball strike zone. I mean the strike zone that's in your own home. It's the area from your chest to the floor in every room. And it's where you should never keep matches. Because if you do, your kids might find them and play with them. And maybe they'll get hurt. Don't let that happen. Keep matches up high, like on a shelf, out of the strike zone. A public service message from the National Fire Protection Association and this station. You know about my strike zone, but do you know about yours? Hi, I'm Rich Gossage. You've got a very important strike zone in your own home. It's the area from your chest to the floor in every room. And it's where you should never keep matches, because it's where your little kids are always looking for things to play with. And if they find matches, they can get hurt. So remember this simple rule. Keep matches out of your strike zone. A public service message from the National Fire Protection Association and this station. The more you know about the strike zone, the safer your kids are. I'm Wilbur Wood, and I'm not talking about the strike zone I'm always pitching at. I'm talking about the strike zone in your home. It's the area from your chest to the floor in every room, and it's where you shouldn't keep matches. It's where your kids spend most of their time looking for things to play with. And if they find your matches, they could get hurt. Don't let that happen. Keep matches out of your strike zone. A public service message from the National Fire Protection Association and this station. The little kids at your house spend most of their time in the strike zone. I am Pat Kelly and I don't mean the baseball strike zone. I mean the strike zone that is in your own home. It is the area from the chest to the floor in every room. And it's where you should not keep matches. Because if you do, your kids might find them and play with them. And they may get hurt. Don't let that happen. Keep matches up high, like on the shelf, out of the strike zone. A message from the National Fire Protection Association and this station. This is Jim Rooker. And I care about two strike zones. One's right over the plate, from the chest to the knees. The other's from the chest to the floor, everywhere in my house, and yours too. It's where we should never keep matches, because it's where our little kids spend all their time looking for things to play with. 
and if they find matches, they can get hurt. So let's remember, keep matches up high out of the strike zone. A public service message from the National Fire Protection Association and this station. Hi, I'm Richie Zisk, and I've got a strike zone to deal with every time I play ball. But did you know that you've got a strike zone too? Right in your own home. It's the area from your chest to your floor in every room. And it's where you should never keep matches. Because little kids spend all their time in the strike zone looking for things to play with. So keep your matches up high, on a shelf or something. Keep your matches out of the strike zone. A public service message from the National Fire Protection Association and this station. Hi, I'm Johnny Bench, and I've got a strike zone to deal with every time I play ball. But did you know that you've got a strike zone too, right in your own home? It's the area from your chest to the floor in every room, and it's where you should never keep matches, because little kids spend all their time in that strike zone looking for things to play with. So keep your matches up high, on a shelf or something. Keep your matches out of the strike zone. A public service message from the National Fire Protection Association and this station. The more you know about the strike zone, the safer your kids are. I'm Gary Nolan, and I'm not talking about the strike zone I'm always pitching at. I'm talking about the strike zone in your home. It's the area from your chest to the floor in every room, and it's where you shouldn't keep matches, because it's where your kids spend most of their time looking for things to play with. And if they find your matches, they could get hurt. Don't let that happen. Store matches out of your strike zone. A public service message from the National Fire Protection Association and this station.